I am Dr. Nanda Rajneesh. I practice as a laparoscopic surgeon and a surgical oncologist in Apollo Spectra and Sakura World Hospital. Acute cholecystitis is nothing but inflammation infection of the gallbladder. Most often it is due to gallstones in the gallbladder. So the without gallstones it is called a calculus cholecystitis but which is less common. So once an individual has acute cholecystitis they will have a lot of abdominal pain severe and could be associated with fever and vomiting and maybe patient also having a colicky pain which is a rolling type intermittent. So and uh, sometimes acute cholecystitis may be associated with mild jaundice and if there is a slippage of stones it can be associated with severe jaundice too. If you visit a doctor within one week then doctor can consider surgery if her liver function test is absolutely normal but if a liver function test is deranged then what we suggest is to look for any stone slippage if it is present normally we admit these patients to treat with higher antibiotics and then we remove the stone if it is present in the CBD through ERCP and endoscopy and then we do a laparoscopic cholecystectomy but if individual has acute cholecystitis progressing even after 2 weeks only if there is a jaundice we have there is an indication for surgery immediate surgery with ERCP but if there is a empyema gallbladder without jaundice still we suggest that patient has to go into surgery immediately.